What do we got? Four. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. John Boat Tournament number four for the year. It's going to be a shallow bite. I have a feeling today. Ace said he was out Tuesday and saw a bunch of fish up on bed, so pretty cool. We'll see what happens. Ace, what do you think? Well, we'll see him. Oh, we'll see him? We'll see him on bed. Oh, Ace has got a secret trick up his sleeve. Two bed fish that I know. We're going to have to go get them later. Starting with the chatterbait, Ace has got a stuck. Oh, no, he doesn't. He had a stick. Say 58? Yeah. Huh. What was it when you were out here Tuesday? 68? 70? So it went, it's down 10 degrees? Yeah. Well, that's good. <laughs> 10 degrees is a lot. I'm gonna scope them all day. They're out chasing bait. I did scope one. They, they back in the winter pattern. Sick. My bad. Number Dude, one. You casted that in there? Did he shoot over to it? Yeah, they super shallow. I wonder if there's another one in there. That was awesome. He's probably two and three quarter. Hell yeah. It's gotta be three. Three forty one. Hell yeah, bro. Let's go. Uh, D-bomb. That was cool. I didn't never saw him. All you were just like, "There's a fish on you." I was like, "Dude, as soon as you dragged it, you must have shot out from here because yeah. I threw right here and started dragging." It came like it must have been up there. Oh, it was up here. Wow. No, no, no. He was like, came from right there at the base. Yeah. This way and just stopped. I was like, "Ooh." That's awesome. I mean, that fish was in six uh, a foot of water. We'll say. I don't know if they'll come up for it, but I feel like that fish that I caught on the Texas rig, if I pulled this over his head, he was probably going to eat it. I mean, he was so shallow. You're good, you're good. Oh, God. Guess the buzzbait will work. He came up and ate it. He couldn't resist the power of the buzz. Number two, 849. We're finding some shallow fish. Buzzbaits all day? I'm gonna run this buzzbait parallel with that, that shallow piece real quick. I knew it would work. With this wind right here, it's perfect. I know. I think it's that slow roll that they like too. Dude, that one didn't even, he just grabbed the skirt and pulled it down basically. Oh, all day. 
Oh, baby, baby. Number three. 936. He's in. Grab him. Or put the net on him. Yeah. Not me. What'd you say? Catch one, buddy. Oh, there's a bite. Oh, I got bit up there too. Nice. Thanks for coming out the fight. I got bit right when you set the hook. Another little little buzzbait fish, non keeper. <laughs> that was pretty small. Flipping and buzz baiting. All you forward facing sonar haters having a field day on this one. Ooh, you know where else I want to look? The cave, the little cove with the power lines. The, oh, the, the, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the yeah, yeah. power lines. Got him. Yeah. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I was aiming for the net, I swear. Oops, sorry. I hope your monster uh, is empty. Okay, 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 okay. Relax. You see three beds? I think there's one right there, right here, right here. 10 15, fish number five going in. That's the second fish I caught on a Texas rig. Sprayed grass deep bomb. That's what I'm throwing. Just trying to imitate a bluegill. That one I was definitely let sit there because I was looking up shallow. Turned around. My line was just running off. Hey guys, sorry for the interruption, but it's time for the Boat of the Week, sponsored by my friends over at Angler's Choice. So this week, we're taking a look at a 2023 Bass Cat Bobcat. This is from Angler's Choice's trade-in program, and the boat is basically brand new. The Bobcat has a 17-foot, 7-inch hull. It's powered by a 150-horsepower Mercury Pro XS with only 8 hours on it. Up front on the bow, you have a Minn Kota Ultrex. This is an 80-pound thrust. And as far as electronics go, you have two Lowrance Elite 9 FS's. You have one up at the bow and one at the console. The boat has a really unique and interesting layout and I can guarantee that it scoots being under 18 feet powered with a 150 horsepower Merc. So if you guys have any interest in this Bass Cat Bobcat, please click the link down in the description below. It'll take you over to Angler's Choice and you can check this thing out. So if this Bass Cat isn't exactly what you were looking for, Angler's Choice is running promotions right now on select 2023 models where you can save up to $15,000 and you can qualify for a $2,000 Bass Pro Shops gift card. So I'll leave those 2023 models linked down below as well. Huge thanks to Angler's Choice for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back into it. Yeah, dude, this is, this looks like Hydrilla or something. Oh, you got one? Good one? Oh yeah, that's a good one. What side are you going? Right in front. That'll work, brother. I knew it. That stuff looked too good. Hell yeah. He's probably two pounds. Attention. <laughs> nice. Buzz baby, let's go. Limit. Ten twenty seven, that's the limit fish. Dude, yeah, your fish ate like here. It's like a foot of water. That's sick. They are shallow. Got him. Oh, 
think he's dead. <laughs> yeah. I don't think he's even gonna do anything. Thought he was gonna be big. Dude, he was up in the tree when I set the hook. It was like, not wrapped, but over a, a branch. Felt big. Actually, this one might call. That small one. 14 incher. The 14 incher. Dude, he got so dark in there. Small call. that good one that'll work now now we're throwing the buzz bait all day right that's a five <laughs> hell yeah ace man all right let's go ace you think is that is that the same one that slurped it earlier that is sick 1724 1724 oh there's a bite I just got bit. Good call on this stop. When I got bit, it was uh, a few big ones. That's a big Come one. Back. Is he coming for you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's dude. nice. Big? What do we need? Ooh, one? he's been chomped on. Uh, one, six, two, I think. Yeah, he's it's probably two, close to two. Yeah, that's a good call. Bye bye. Three oh five. We got about fifty minutes left to fish. 17 and a half pounds. Need a couple more big ones. What do you think we'll win it today, Ace? 25? Yeah, I was going to say mid 20. Mid 20s? Yeah. Damn, this looks perfect. This is like the perfect amount of wind. Got a little grass, little wood, big flat. Mm. Eat the buzz. The last fish we caught was when we were just above beaver, right? It was all at beaver, yeah. Crazy, dude. There's like nothing going on up here. Yeah, it's got grass, it's got wood. All right, last cast. Yep, there's nothing there. And so be it. Seventeen point six eight. Sure. Yeah. That's about right. Seventeen six eight. Seventeen sixty eight. That was less than I did. Did you see those PB? Huh? Oh, did he catch it? How big? I don't know. That's the fourth That's the time. It's insane. That's the hungriest fish on the Let me put that. I want to grab my camera real quick. That's awesome. Think it's the same one? Same one? 
Hang on, I'm gonna grab my camera. There's that dot. This is the lake record caught again for the fourth time. Look at that. That's insane. That is insane. What's up, buddy? I missed you. <laughs> So Ace and I finished up with 17 pounds and change, and I think it got a sixth or seventh place, something like that. But 22 pounds won this event, and I think one of the most exciting things of the entire tournament was that the lake record fish was caught again. So it wasn't bigger than the lake record, but it was the same fish. So if you guys remember a couple years back, I caught the lake record, and it was 985 when I caught it. And... I caught it again, like the following year, post-spawn, it was 890 something. Since then, this year alone, it's been caught two other times. We will do another video on that if you guys leave me some comments down below and you want to see it. So, it was a fun one. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please hit that subscribe button for me. We'll see you on the next one.